you guys doing today? So, I made a video this morning uh, talking about restarting the channel up here. Um, so, I decided what the heck. Let's just do a uh, um, review and see how it goes. So, I'm a little rusty. It's been four years since I actually did a review. So, let's see how it goes. But today I have um, Tapatio Extra Spicy ramen noodle soup so if you guys can see right there um i, I really don't do i like spicy food it's good but when tapatio says hey this is gonna be extra spicy it's probably just gonna be mild honestly um but i'll, I'll give it a shot i will heat it up and see what it says let's just say Microwave directions, boil water directions, instructions, okay. And then it's the rest of the instructions are in Spanish, which is no good to me. So, um, yeah, it says it's the hottest, hottest, hottest. But uh, let's see how it goes. So I'm going to go ahead and get this going. I no. I'm really not going to show you in my kitchen how I make this. I'm just going to make it and then come back and try it. <laughs> so give me a few and I'll come back and let you guys know how it, how it tastes. See if it's really spicy or not. All right. You guys have a good one and I'll be back in a few. All righty. Uh, so we're back. So excuse if I'm a little bit nervous because it's been... Like I said, four years since I made a video, kind of rusty, trying to get back into it and stay into it. Um, but yeah, so the funny, the funny thing is, is that I read the instructions to make this soup, made it. Uh, of course, here it is right here. It's still hot, so I'll let it chill out for a little bit. But um, it's funny because you buy this soup. It's not that expensive. I think it was like a dollar twenty for this thing. But... You look at it in the like the the noodle puck or whatever you call it, the noodle thing is like this big, legitimately this big, and so it was flipped to its side. And I'm like, dang! And then you fill the water to the fill line. I did the microwave uh, um, directions, so it tells you to fill the water to the fill line. But then you're sitting there watching the freaking thing in the microwave to make sure it doesn't overflow because you know it's going to overflow. I mean, you can't make a cup of noodle soup without it overflowing in the microwave. It just does every time. I, I, it's just something that happens. So you're sitting there watching it bubble up, and then you gotta open the door real shit real quick, and then close the door real quick, and then start it. So I don't know. It is what it is, I guess. But so let's check it out. I mean, it's still really hot. I mean, oh shit, look, it's hot. Steaming, piping everywhere. Um. I don't know if I do ramen noodle videos in injustice by not using chopsticks because I really, I mean, I can use them, but I'm not really good at using them. So, um, I stick with the American way, you know, good old fork. Um, let's see, well, let's give it a whirl, see how spicy it is. I'm really not anticipating like a huge amount of spice, honestly, but... Oh yeah, shit, this stuff's way too hot. Oh, a little chill for another minute, but um, so this channel I had started about I don't know five years ago. I was doing just like uh, quick cooking videos, um, food review videos, vlogs, um, just stupid stuff that I like to do, and just to put it on the ch on on the web. Mostly just because I like to, you know, go back and look at it, and I'm really bad with saving stuff on my phone. I'm, like, horrible at it. Um, so I'm able to, you know, go back and look at it. Um, am I trying to get rich off this stuff? No. Do I plan on making a lot of money? No. I got 80 subscribers. I mean, how much money can you really make? But I enjoy doing it. I enjoy just putting it out there and just looking at it, you know, see who looks at it and 
you know, who comments and I try to call them back, but so yeah, that's about it. You know, I'm not into the whole muk mukbang video, watching people eat food. Like that's weird. Um, I mean, I, I like this, you know, doing the food reviews where like you take a few bites and then call it a day, but you know, I'm not trying to get any, you know, I'm not trying to become like a huge fat ass. I'm trying to like just review stuff to see if, you know, I recommend it or not. You know, I'm not going to sit here and eat, you know, this whole thing in front of you because honestly, that's weird. I'm, <laughs> uh, I don't enjoy watching that kind of stuff, but let's give it a whirl. So we do the whole twirl method. Still piping hot. <laughs> you know what this smells like? It smells like, like, cheap, um, uh, <laughs> Cheap microwave enchiladas. I mean, that's what it smells like to me. Let's try it again. It's not really spicy. I really don't. I mean, it has a little tingle, like, you know, a little tingle on the palate, but it's not like, it's not like, I'm not like mind blown with spice. But yeah, if you can see, it's like, I mean, it's, I mean, Let's try it again. It's hot, but it was, you know, it's like temperature hot more than spicy hot, honestly. I guess for a cup of noodle, uh, tapatio extra spicy. I mean, I remember the cup of noodle spicy chicken stuff. It's pretty much the same. It's not like, it's not like, I don't feel like I need to drink a water or anything, but I don't know. I would recommend it. So I was looking at uh, some of the other videos I did in the past and I forgot about my grading system. I had like an A to a, a plus to like an F minus as far as if I wanted to recommend this to somebody. Um, I, let's see, I would give this probably... C plus? Yeah. Would I buy this? I would buy it, but would I buy it to crave it? Probably not. Um, would I buy it to throw on my lunch for work just so I had something to eat? Yeah, I would, but I'm not going to go be like, oh, I'm going to go to the grocery store and go to my local Kroger's and, and get a Tapatio extra spicy because that's something that I feel like I need right now, but it's good. And, you know, it's it's average it's good it's average you know give it a whirl if you want if not you're probably not missing much but all right so that concludes the first food review um i'm nervous as hell i'm not gonna lie but you know um a person that i reconnected with was like you know encouraging me you know why not why not you know start the channel back up so thank you to you but um I will, you know, keep it going and make videos and vlogs and whatnot and see how it goes. All right, guys, you guys take care and thank you and have a great night.